don't you think it's about time to party? Tonight is a chance for us to reflect. Hey. You mean no one else is coming? Well, this is all to a hopping start. <laughs> you all are a bright and shining future. I wanted to start, I read this in style interview you did with Hunter Harris, which I loved, and you talked about wanting your first feature to be a love story like Titanic. And I mean, this isn't that, but I do think that there is this sort of like sweeping romance to this film. And I kind of wondered where you saw the romance. Oh, well, I think it's a bromance, you know? I think <laughs> it's a, a, a film where you get the opportunity to see uh, where men do create, it is, it is, uh, a, a, a thing that actually happens where black men do create a safe space amongst themselves to be able to share their fears, their concerns, to be vulnerable, to celebrate each other. Um, we don't get a chance to see that too often. And um, uh, it, it's, it was a big deal for me reading it on, on the page to realize it on the screen. This is your, your feature directorial debut, but you've done tons of television and excelled in that arena. But what surprised you most about directing film? You know, I guess uh, not a lot of surprises because um, I've been acting for 30 something years and I've done mm -hmm. so much uh, film as an actor uh, that, uh, you know, I understand the, 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 the process and that it moves slower than television and, uh, just those differences. Uh, but, you know, I, I was directing a lot of TV in preparation for this moment. So um, I, I feel like I, it definitely helped prepare me, helped to prepare me for this moment. You, you started shooting this at the beginning of last year. And I think it's easy to say the world has changed in many, many ways since then, not least of which is just that there's so much more support behind the Black Lives Matter movement now. And I wonder how you see this story in conversation with the present and specifically Black Lives Matter? Uh, well, this story was really, has always been timely. You know, it's never, even before the 60s, uh, these conversations were happening, it's especially Malcolm's passion mm -hmm. and uh, some of the dialogue uh, that you hear in the film. So a lot of that comes from some uh, historical tragedies that were happening to black people in the 60s prior to that moment, the night that we met them. So um, I feel like history has been doing that all of our lives, but the hope is that um, we won't be here again, having conversation, saying how timely something is hmm. that has been timely throughout because that's kind of the fabric of America. Have to be there for each other. Who's the greatest? Brothers could move mountains without lifting a finger. 